Hello everyone, I'm back with another look through. This time of uh, Pro Wrestling Illustrated and all uh, from winter 1988. Uh, the British Bulldogs, Teddy Biasi vs. Randy Savage, and Lex Luger vs. Ric Flair on the cover. So, Bulldog vs. Bulldog, it really happened, and we have photos. Randy Savage vs. Ted DiBiase, how this feud controls Hulk Hogan's destiny. Are the horsemen protecting Ric Flair from Lex Luger? I don't know. Introduction. Best of dressing room confidential. What a great uh, photo of the Puffos. Randy, Lanny, and Angelo. Never really s see that with, uh, never see Angelo with his two sons hardly in the magazines. On assignment by Liz Hunter. Revealed Paul Erling's plot to brainwash Arn Anderson. <laughs> the rebirth of, magnif of magnificent Morocco. Holy shit, this guy was huge. The Von Erich extravaganza. Yeah. The Road Warriors threaten the AWA. Take your belts and shove them. Huh. Bulldog vs. Bulldog. Oh, yeah, that, uh... I think that happened before they were ever tag team partners. <laughs> I think. How the fans are destroying Jim Garvin. Wow, what an older photo of Jim Garvin. Definitely not what he looked like in 88. <laughs> Are the horsemen protecting Ric Flair from Lex Luger? Probably. Now we got some color photos. This is uh, Raymond Rougeau. Sting without his makeup. Which is rare. Um, Jammer from uh, Jammer's Pro Wrestling Collection, Wrestling Magazine Collection, um, did recently did a um, cool video on a, a Sting through the magazines, and he said that um, he liked uh, Sting, that his favorite version of Sting was uh, the Surfer, Blonde Sting, and I have to say that's my favorite too. I haven't. Uh, I haven't commented on that video yet, but uh, check his videos, check his video out, his channel. Uh, I always link it in my uh, in my description, along with Pro Wrestling Mags, who also does a great job at showing you uh, everything he has in his collection, and every magazine, wrestling, every wrestling magazine on demand. So, uh, here's Precious, and uh, Kevin Von Erich. All right, Randy Savage vs. Ted DiBiase. How this feud controls Hulk Hogan's destiny. Press conference, Michael Hayes. of the articles in the front. Paul Erling. Looking at George Steele.
Uh, Pro Wrestling Official Ratings. Alright, let's see who uh, was what and where. I'll pick randomly as I always do. Most hated. Number one, Andre the Giant. Number two, Ric Flair. Number three, Ted DiBiase. Number four, Barry Windham. Number five, Rick Rude. Number six, The Honky Talk Man. Number seven, Eddie Gilbert. Number eight, Kurt Henning. Number nine, Ronnie Garvin. And number ten, Manny Fernandez. Well, let's do uh, NWA from Winter 88. World champion was Ric Flair. Number one was Barry Windham. Number two was Lex Luger. Number three was Sting. Number four was Dusty Rhodes. Number five was Steve Williams. Number six was El Perez. Number seven was Nikita Koloff. Number eight was Mike Rotunda. Number nine was Larry Sabisco. And number ten was Ronnie Garvin. Do uh, one more. Tag teams. Number one, Tully Blanchard and Arn Anderson. Also known as the Brain Busters. Well, they were the Brain Busters in WWF. Number two, the Road Warriors. Number three, Demolition. Number four, Bobby Eaton and Stan Lane. Number five, the Fantastics. They were a good team, the Fantastics. Number six, Warlord and Barbarian. Number seven, Pat Tanaka and Paul Diamond. Number eight, the Rock and Roll Express. Number nine, Carrie and Kevin Von Erich. Number ten, Ryan Pillman and Bruce Hart. Those are some of the official ratings from winter 1988. The last word. And that will do it for Pro Wrestling Illustrated and all from winter 1988. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. Bye for now.